You guys talked the past couple days about just how locked in you needed to be to find success against this team. How did you execute that in this game one? Uh, getting stops. Uh, I knew uh, when we first started what type of game it was going to be, whoever was going to try to outscore each other. Um, but I, I kept telling the teammates, you know, everybody, you know, whoever gets a stop first is going to win this game. I think you guys forced 16 turnovers in this game. How would you describe the defense that you played? Uh, aggressive. Uh, we knew what we, uh, uh, when we had shooting around, we was focused, we was ready for this game. Um, and we knew when we came out, we wanted to be the first to be aggressive. You're uh, new, I guess, to Jamal Murray in the playoffs. I How knew to him. I, I played against him for a while, but on, on this know, side, yeah, on this side, how yeah. would you describe playing alongside him? Oh uh, man, just amazing. Like, I always tell him, man, yeah, he keep us going. You know, he's our leader. He's, uh, he has the ball in his hand most of the time. So just, you know, just keep, keep playing hard, you know, be you. I always tell him that. How good did it feel to knock down those, those first couple threes that you hit in big moments? Uh, it felt good. I mean, I wish I had a better second half, but it, it felt great, you know, just to see the ball go in. Uh, and I'll definitely be ready for next game. How important was Coach's message at that quick timeout in the third quarter to get you guys kind of uh, I mean, we already knew. Yeah. I mean, he didn't have to say too much. Uh, we knew uh, we came out sloppy when they got the uh, offensive rebound, free throw, and then the steal, turnover. Uh, so we knew uh, when, we, when they, he called the timeout what we had to do. What were the biggest adjustments you made in that really tight first quarter, and then you guys kind of just took control from the second, didn't let up? Uh, like I said earlier, we, we was the first team to get stops, uh, like three stops in a row, uh, make them miss. Uh, and got rebound and got out in transition where we best at. Um, and I think we did that uh, to open up that second quarter. How would you guys feed off Aaron Gordon shooting 100% <laughs> in the first half? I mean, what you're I'm, I always tell AG, man, you open, shoot it. Like, because you, you're a great shooter, man. You've been working on it uh, in the summertime. Just, man, you open, shoot the ball. You know, just make sure you get it above the rim. DB has talked about watching you, wanting to emulate kind of the style of player that you are. He had four steals in this game. How did you see him come alive on the defensive end? Um, CB is great. You know, he, when he checks in, he, he always brings that energy off the bench. Uh, no matter what it is, getting offensive rebound, rebounding for us, pushing in transition, scoring in transition, or even making open shots. Uh, but tonight, man, he played well uh, defensively, and we needed off the bench. How do you replicate this effort? Uh, come in and be ready like we did this uh, game one. Be aggressive uh, and be the first team to get stops. What can you say about Bruce Brown's uh, contribution, that steal that he had and all, before the dunk, or after the dunk that he had? What That seemed like the dagger in a sense. Can you nah, Bruce, you no, know, he, he played amazing. You know, it doesn't, doesn't matter. Like, Bruce can always defend. Uh, I, I like, uh, we always talk about, like, how I'm more of a passing lane, you know, player, and he, he can play better on ball defense than me. Uh, he can get the steals and get lower than I can, but, you know, I'm, I'm proud of him, and he, he played well tonight. Um, just being aggressive, pushing up, uh, showing them different coverages, uh, and just making sure we get a contestant every shot. What's up with the denim jacket that you guys all got? Uh, some the, the the wives came up with. Uh, I'm new to this, so Jeff Jeff was telling me about it, so I'm, I'm new to it, so I got to make sure she get it. Katie and Booker combined to shoot, I think, just four threes in the game. How were you guys able to manipul manipulate their offense to kind of make them play the way you wanted them to play offensively? Um, our game plan. You know, our coaches, they had a great game plan for us, and we just came out and executed it.